What is good, everybody in YouTube land? It is me, it is the Mass Man, and I'm here again for another video. Uh, I don't think I'm going to leave my email just yet. I, I believe I'm going to wait until I get some more people in here, get some more people commenting, get some more people talking about it, about this thing before I go back into the email shit. You know, I used to leave my email at the end of every video and put it in the comments. But, you know, when my viewership slowed, it just didn't seem like a pertinent thing to do. Uh, it takes time to type out all that shit. So I'm just putting watch me in the, in the thing. And if somebody wants to leave me a comment, just leave your comments down below. And um, let me know what you'd like to see me talk about next. Let me know what you what subject you would like to hear from me, and we'll go from there. But in this video, I want to talk about how I, Mr. Mass Man, have become a hater. Um, when I was young, I used to grow up thinking I'd be rich. I thought I'd live in a castle, you know, size building, I'd have 54 rooms. I'd drive any kind of nice car I wanted to drive. I was never really a car person, so I can't say that I would drive any nice car. But, you know, I always wanted the big house. That was my thing, the big house. Living in a nice big house that I paid for, you know, and shit like that. But now I'm 28 years old. You know, I work at a grocery store. You know, and I don't like the job. You know, it's kind of physical, you know, back breaking work. It's not it's not a hell of a lot to do, but it's it's too much for me. So that's my life. And I just look back on all the moments that I wasted, all the time that I wasted all the mistakes that I've made and I just I've just become a hater of people now. Anytime I listen to an interview, you know, I used to could listen to an interview from a from a Russell Simmons or you know, Charlemagne interview somebody and you know, I I'd be interested in, in taking the information in. I'd be interested. Now now all I do is just hate on the person. And say, man, they got it, and I don't got it. Fuck them. So that's what it's turned into. It's turned into, you know, my ambition, my will to succeed has turned into hatred. And I feel like that's actually kind of normal. For a guy in my situation, I, I don't have much. I don't I don't I don't have a girlfriend, I don't have a good paying job, I'm fat, I'm tired all the time, I almost throw up every time I eat. So my life is not really going the best. My life is not really doing the most. So it's natural that I'd be a hater. It's natural. And I just want for people to realize that if your life isn't going the way that you want it to go, then you may become a hater as well. But don't let that hate consume you. Don't let that hate eat you up. Don't, don't let the hate make you feel bad because it's natural. You're not killing anybody. You're not hurting anybody. You're just hating on a celebrity. You're just hating on somebody who is successful, more successful, or more successful than you are, or someone who is successful in general. It's natural. I'm a hater, man. I'm a hater. I just, I just embrace it, man. Because chances are, this YouTube shit ain't going to work out. Chances are I'm not going to be famous, internet famous or otherwise. Chances are I'm going to be grinding out these 
these videos that nobody watches and I'm and I'm watching people who who got people watching them and they're gonna do great and they're gonna be on talk shows and they're gonna be talking about their life and their career and I'm just gonna be here you know getting older getting dumber you know that type of shit so I've become a hater So, I don't, I don't really know what the origins of, of all my hate is, but I think it just in the fact that I am a failure, that I have become a failure, that I've become a loser, and I am one, I am a failure, I'm a, I am a loser. So... To dig myself out of the hole, I don't know what it's going to take. I don't know who it's going to take. But I hope I find it. I hope I find the thing that can pull me up. Because that's what I hate the most, is that these people, they talk about their success. These celebrities, they talk about their success. But they don't talk about how a guy who's not going after an active role can be successful. They don't talk about how a guy can, from Shreveport, Louisiana, they don't talk about how a guy like me, could do better. The closest thing that I saw was the flipping, but flipping items. But that shit is hard, man. That's hard work to figure all that shit out and then be successful at it. So I don't want to get thrown up in that and spend all my money and not make a dime. So that's out. But you know, I don't know, man. I'm just, I'm just this guy who doesn't have any friends, who doesn't have a girl, who doesn't make that much money, who's been watching these clowns talk about their shit for a long, long time, and who's fed up with it now. I don't want to hear what anybody has to say about being successful. Just entertain me. Make your song. Do your show. And shut the fuck up. You know, I try to listen to an interview every now and again, but I, shit is rough for me, man. I I just be finding myself getting emotional about how I've struggled and haven't progressed. So it really just it really just fucks with me. It really bothers me. To see people give this generic ass advice, give these generic ass facts and feel like they're doing something. But I don't know, man. Will I always be a hater? I hope not. I hope one day something, because it's going to have to be something outside of me, myself. Hopefully one day something comes along that changes my circumstances for the better. And allows me to live a prosperous life, a happy life. I want that. I know all of you want that. You know, maybe not for me, but you want it for yourself. And I'm just trying to figure out how to get it. I, I don't think it's in any of the books that I've read or any of the books that I could read. I don't. I don't see where, I don't see how I could do better. I don't see how I could be successful. I don't see how. I hope there's some kind of way, but I don't see it. And it frustrates me. And then I got to listen to people who got money, who got, who got their lives going in a certain direction, who got a comfortable life. And I'm just saying, man, my life ain't comfortable. I sleep all the time because I don't want to deal with what I got to deal with. And it drags me down and it pulls me down. But I don't want to hold you guys too long. I don't want to make this video too long, too, too long. But I just wanted to say it because somebody got to say that they're a hater.
And somebody got to say that they're a failure. Somebody got to say that they're a loser, right? Somebody got to be the loser, right? So why can't it be me? Like I said before, I don't know what this channel is going to be. And I hope I'm not always bitching all the time every time I get on a video to make a video. But sometimes I got to get the evil out because I ain't got nobody to talk to. This. I, I don't have anybody to talk to about these things. I don't have anybody to speak with about these things. And not just speak to them, but in a way that would constructively help me to work my way out of it. Nobody knows how I can get out of this. Nobody is aware of any way I can go that would help me escape this fate that could help me escape this shitty, shitty life I live. Nobody has that information. So I'm, so I'm stuck. I'm grounded. I'm trapped like a rat. <sighs> but it does feel good to get it out. It does feel good to say it. It feels good to say I'm a failure, to admit it. <laughs> to admit it in public. That's what I am. I'm a, I'm a loser. I'm, I really am. I really am a loser. I really am a failure. And that, and that makes me a hater. Because nobody taught me how to do shit. Nobody showed me the game. Nobody taught me the game. Nobody made sure that I knew it. My father didn't do that. My mother didn't do that. They didn't sit me down and made sure that I knew the game and prepared me for anything that could happen in life. They didn't do it. So now I'm a hater. I hate things. I hate people. I'm a hater. I hate to see somebody doing better than me. And that's almost everybody. I'm a hater. Because I don't like hearing about somebody's success. I'm a hater. So show me the way. Guide me if you got it. If you got it like that. Show me how to get it. I'm willing. I'm willing to do what I got to do. But there's this nigga in my city, Jason Black. There's this nigga in my city who I can't even get a hold of. Now, I know this guy knows what to do. But I can't even get a, get a hold of him. I don't know who he is. I don't know what he looks like. I don't know where to find him. He ain't got... He, he, he doesn't have any presence in the city. He has no physical presence. He's just some guy who lives here. Jason Black. Been trying to get in touch with that nigga for a while. Hate that nigga too. Talking ass. Talks on videos two, three hours. You can make yourself accessible to niggas. You can make yourself available for people who want to get in contact with you some way besides calling your fucking radio show. You could do it if you wanted to. If you wanted to really be of service, if you really wanted to be of help, you could do it. But you don't want to do it, nigga. So I'm a hater. I can't listen to that shit no more. I can't listen to this nigga talk for three and four and five fucking hours about whatever. And I'm struggling. And this shit you talking about ain't helping me get out of my situation. I can't stand it no more. I can't take it. I can't fucking take it. It's too much. This fucking loser, this failure can't handle all this talk. I need some entertainment or I need some some guidance. And where do I go to get guidance? Where do I go to get help? Where do I go to get taught? Where do I go to learn how to get out of this shit? Where can I go? I already been to school. Can't go back. Old Southern University, $2,000 for housing. I couldn't go in because I went bipolar at home. And... I couldn't, they wouldn't let me go back to school. I tried, but they wouldn't let me go back. So now I owe them money. Now I can't get my transcripts. Now I can't go back to school. So what am I supposed to do? Help me out. What am I supposed to do to not be a hater? Why shouldn't I be a hater? Why shouldn't I hate niggas? I don't know, man. Like I said, I don't want this video to be too long. But I just I just feel some type of way. I just feel some type of way about it. 
And I may make more videos about being a hater, about being a, about being a failure and a loser. Because I feel like I need to face who I am. I need to face what I am so I can move forward in life. So I can move forward. So I can get to where I need to go. Because I can't, I can't stay here forever and, and be sane and be cool. That ain't going to work. It's not going to work, man. Shit going to drive me up the wall. It's going to drive me crazier. It's going to make me bent. So, I'm just hoping that someday one of these videos will get to somebody who can help, who can help this nobody be a somebody. <sighs> I'm just hoping. Anyway, y'all, that's been this video. I appreciate you for watching. If you watched, um, I want to thank you. I appreciate you. I love you. You are the greatest. Thank you very much for checking out my shit. Um, and give me something to talk about. I always say give me something to talk about. I, I watch the videos. There be one or two views. No comments. So I guess people don't don't care what I talk about. So if you care, if you want me to talk about something specific, if you want me to talk about something, you know, that you want to hear somebody speak on, send me an email, send me a link. And let me know what it is so I can talk about it. You know, I'm, I'm here for you. I'm here for you, man. I'm here to, to, to bring you whatever you want to see, whatever you need to see. I'm there. I'm here to help you to be of service, really be of service. So show me, show me what you got. All right, that's all I got for y'all, man. I want to keep talking, but I know I need to cut this video off. So enjoy your day. Enjoy your night. You know, peace, man. Peace.